U.S. military embargo makes Indonesia accidental windfall of cheap and exciting C-705 missile technology transfer. Currently, Indonesia can engineer its own C-705 anti-ship missile. In fact, previously Indonesia was still a consumer country regarding anti-ship missiles before the arrival of the C-705. The presence of the C-705 anti-ship missile was actually not something that Indonesia had planned. The C-705, was originally a replacement solution for the expired U.S.-made Harpoon anti-ship missiles on the Indonesian Ahmadiyani-class frigates. It's not that Indonesia can't afford Harpoon, it's that the U.S. military embargo prohibits it. Instead of worrying about begging the U.S. to immediately release the military embargo, Indonesia is taking practical steps. While China needs an export market for C-705 anti-ship missiles, Indonesia has four opportunities to take it. It didn't take long for China to agree to Indonesia's request. China asked Indonesia to buy more anti-ship missiles from it. Indonesia agrees. Apart from the C-705, Indonesia is also buying the C-802. This C-802 was finally installed on the Ahmadiyani-class frigate. As if getting a windfall, China also transferred the C-705 technology to Indonesia. Moreover, the price of this missile is quite cheap, per unit priced at ID or 20 billion. Compare this with Exoset MM40 Block III, which reaches ID or 64 billion per unit, so that the process of making the Indonesian-engineered C-705 missile will soon be realized. An Indonesian consortium consisting mostly of state-owned enterprises has been formed to reverse-engineer a type of anti-ship missile with the aim of building domestic capabilities. Jane saw that Indonesia did not exclusively announce the type of anti-ship missile it was making. However, the photo circulating is indeed a copy of the C-705, resulting from collaboration with China. The Defense Ministry statement did not reveal the types of missiles that would be involved in the reverse engineering process. However, the image accompanying his statement is very similar to the C-705 medium-range anti-ship missile produced by China Aerospace Science and Industry Corporation, COSIC, he explained. Initially, many were skeptical about the C-705's capabilities because it came from China. But now, after Indonesia has fired this missile several times, and the results are satisfactory, the public is convinced of the C-705's capabilities. Military observers smelled intelligence activities carried out by China when transferring C-705 technology to Indonesia. Military observers smelled intelligence activities carried out by China when transferring C-705 technology to Indonesia. China provided at least 18 or more C-705 anti-ship missiles in 2015, alone, and Indonesia will also assemble C-705s locally, explained Chinese media Haiwai on October the 11th. 2016, the C-705 is indeed an anti-ship missile engineered by Indonesia itself. As a result of the U.S. military embargo, 